Hello all, Jeff here with a new video back on Project Cars 2. As you may know, the World Endurance Championship went to Spa Francorchamps on the weekend and they experienced snowy conditions. So I thought I'd do the same, but at Old Spa. So we'll see how we go here. Right, here we go. Um, I'm having camera issues because my PC, well, well the PC's having issues, so I can, hence why I can't record the um camera reaction but you do at least get the commentary anyway use a high repel get by this LMP2 see you later mate as we go down O Rouge up the Radion these guys are just oh, going really slow here mainly being because of turn one oh, mate let me through you my teammate and I ran out of high repel see if I can get by this Audi which I have yes I have um, this is normally a straight these days and we go like home normally it's a chicane that leads to the right instead it's a hard left oh no <laughs> oh no big incident oh. oh there's a few GT cars just so you know that there's they exist here let's try that again all right we start again so yeah, weirdly, LMP1 and LMPH are different classes, even though they meant to be the same. But anyway, here we go. Let's go. Get by the P2. Oh! <laughs> Just savagely get past the Porsche. Is it a Porsche? Yes, it is. Get by another one. See you later. Alright, so this is Camel, as I said. Normally a straight, but... Oh, mate! What are you doing? Use your hybrid! Unless they're saving it for later on. Uh, hopefully we don't have another start for carnage. Hard on the brakes. Uh, I'm going to easily get by the Toyota now. Save the hybrid for later on because I tend to... Oh, now he's using his hybrid. Great. Look at me. I just left for dust. The Porsche that I got by at Overridge Randy on, he's going to try and get by me as well. There he goes. So these guys are in a rush all of a sudden. But um, do you have to be mindful with snowy conditions, the water spraying up. It's very hard to see at times. Oh, just kept it off the fence. No, I'm not using hybrid yet. Oh, the Porsche, what are you doing? <laughs> and there goes the other one. No, I'm not leaving. I own all sorts of issues with the guys up front. People on the brakes, so hopefully we don't have another incident. Here we go. Oh, no. We'll see you later, Porsche. That was my fault. Um, damage turned off, luckily. But these guys up front, I don't know. They're going straight wide. It's not possible at this spa. <laughs> not bad. They've kept it on the track somehow. And I've got hybrid, so I may as well use it once we finish the uphill section. You know, I'm going to use it now. Stuff it. Let's go. We kind of worked. Just easily get by that Audi. Now, oh, more people on the brakes. Now, we're about to get to the point where the where the new where the current spa meets the old spa. So I'm going to get by this guy. Um, this is pretty much the, the spa, we're pretty much on the current spa circuit now. As you can see, it looks very different because it's basically paddock fences for fences, not very safe at all. And now we're about to go to the slight left hand of Kink and then to Blanchemont. So we're about to go to Blanchemont now. There we go. Slight lift because it's, you know, very, very treacherous conditions. Um, no bus stop chicane, so just go straight straight by and we're going to go into La Source. Do I make the move? Yeah, I made the move on one guy. Not bad. Let's get by this Audi. He's got the same idea as me though, so I'll stay behind him for Overage Radion, see how we go. Back off just in case. Nicely taken, is it? Connor. Won't use a hybrid now, that way I 
got a bit for later on in the lap because yeah with these things see what I mean I can't see a thing <laughs> all this water spraying oh got away with that somehow oh, come on let's get by this guy no not gonna happen oh what is he doing that's the problem when people go too wide you can't see a thing no matter which way you go so oh I'm actually fourth I did not think I'd be in this kind of position that I am oh the top two are, are too wide which is something you don't want to do at Old Spa because it's very narrow especially this section here yeah, it's flat but if you got if you're driving side by side it's going to cause issues I'm not going to use my hybrid yet because we're going to use it later on in the lap where I'm most vulnerable to the AI. The AI is set to 100, but um, we'll see how we go here. So it's just a three lap race, but um, I couldn't imagine doing a six hour race on this bar. Just imagine. There would have been all sorts of carnage. It's a bit of a death trap of a track just looking at all these fences which probably do nothing. I always seem to lose a bit of speed there, but anyway. Uh, I don't know if I've said it before, but I've, yeah, I've got camera issues, so unfortunately you can't see my face for this video. No problem with the streams though, but anyway, that happens sometimes. So here we go, into this section, a slightly put it into six, hitting the fence, which I shouldn't be doing. Um, and I'm going to have to use my hybrid to get to get away from the guys behind me, because they, they had a much better launch out of that corner than I did, and I'm going to be extremely vulnerable. Um, for this next section, um, which is very long, mind you, only two proper braking spots here on the track. So I'm going to be very vulnerable even before we get to Blanchemont. So this guy, um, I don't know if it's Marek or the RWD, he's going to get by me easily. So let's try and get in his slipstream and see if I can do anything about this and see if I can get by him at La Source. As you can see, I've lost so much ground to the leaders. Um, Hang on. Oh, I've got a bit of a slip stream going. I'm going to get by him at Blanchemont. May as well. Yes, that's how you do it. <laughs> there would be runoff there um, these days, but, you know, it's what, the 60s or the 70s, this track, so that wasn't there. As we break hard into La Source. Not very hard, but just enough so I don't go off the track. Whoa, there we go, a bit of oversteer moment, nice. Get a little bit of hybrid going. Save some for the rest of the lap. Here we go. Ro Rouge Radeon. <laughs> it's just so much tighter than it is these days. And it comes by very quick in these cars as well, so um <laughs> it's um very tricky. Ro Rouge Radeon's always been tricky, mind you. But, ha but having no runoff there makes it even more of a challenge. Break into the comb now. There we go. Nice. That's how you do it. Save some of the hybrid for later in the lap, even though I'm still going to be vulnerable to this AI. Anyway, just keep it flat. See what happens. Use a little bit here. Just so I've got the Porsche at bay. No, you're not going through, mate. And, yeah. He's backing off, good stuff. Oh, thanks, mate. Thanks, crew chief. Yeah, this section is very, very... Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. That's no good. Come on. You know, second in LMPH, but, you know, it, it, they, the LMPH car should be in LMP1 because there's a bunch of LMP1 hybrids in LMP1. Yeah, it's weird, I know. <laughs> and the Porsche, he's going to get by me, is he? Yes, he is. Oh, that's a brave move from him, let's be honest. Very, very brave indeed. Got a little bit of hybrid, but it's going to do nothing, let's be honest. I'm going to need to stay in the Porsche slipstream the entirety of this next straight section. So here we go. Uh, he took that a lot better than me. I need to stay in his slipstream if I'm going to be any chance, but that's not going to help because the other Porsche, he's just going to easily get by me. Maybe the hybrid is a lot stronger on the Porsche, but look at them fly by. Look at that. And I, yeah, 
they're probably too abreast, so I can't see a thing. Well, they're starting to pull away, so I can see a thing now, but, um, they all seem to be in a rush, like they're going to the post office at 5 o'clock, really wanting to get out of the office after a bad day at work. But anyway, uh, it's just, it is frustrating, like, how strong the AI is with their straight line speed, because I can match them on the corners if I get it right, but... It, they're not even slipstreaming and they're getting so much more power than me. Anyway, we're about to get into Blanchemont. I'm going to try and take this flat. Yeah, nice work. Slight cut, but penalties, I've turned them off. And then again, it is an old circuit, so you can't really extend anywhere. Anyway, we're going to break hard into La Source. Maybe I can get by one of them. Am I going to get by this guy? I gave him a bit of a tap. I've got hybrid though, so I might be able to get by him. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, I got by him. Nice. Still, I was almost at the lead at the start of lap two. That just shows how strong the AI is in this game. But yeah, um... <laughs> Old Spa wouldn't work these days because the hybrid system... Um, the Toyotas, they, you know, they, they could be vulnerable, vulnerable to the rebellions because they, they're, you know, they'd be running out of hybrid power very quickly since there's only really only two braking spots on the track, especially if it's dry. And anyway, there you have it. So if you like the video, smash the thumbs up button, leave a comment, let me know what you think, and if you want to see more, subscribe and tap the notification icon. Anyway, this is Jeff here, and happy racing. Cheers.